Hello and welcome to this edition of Biology Bites. Now today I'll be talking about how to know when they're on a crawdad bite. Well there's actually three ways that you can really tell if they're on a crawdad bite. First off, if you look in their mouth and there's either antennas or claws sticking out of their stomach, they're on a crawdad bite. Uh, sometimes you might see a piece of shell or a claw sticking out of their butt. That's also a pretty good clue they're on a crawdad bite. But I think the main way to tell if they're on a crawdad bite is look in their mouths. If their jaws are red, if right before their stomach is all red, if their gillets are red, that's a pretty good sign they're on a crawdad bite. Now there's different stages of this. I mean, you might see antennas or claws sticking out, you might see something, but you don't really know if they're, you know, eating it all the time or just sometimes, because they'll always eat crawdads if they can find them. But if their mouth is really, really red, just like, like I said, the jaws, right before the stomach, the gillets, everything is red, 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 that's your clue. They're really eating pretty much nothing but crawdads. And I have some footage of a bass I caught, and well, if you look in this one's mouth, it's pretty much a dead ringer. They're eating nothing but crawdads. Let's check out the footage. All right. I just got a, a good fish, 710. Two ounces away from seven and three quarter, but I just want to show you what the inside of a mouth looks like when they're on a crawdad bite. That's how red, and his lips are red, his whole gillets are red. I mean, red, red, red. That's what it looks like inside their mouth when they're eating crawdads. It's not because crawdads are red, it's just because they get all irritated and scuffed because they're chewing down on those hard shells. Alright, I'm just getting ready to do one on what they look like when they're feeding on crawdad, and I think that's a good example. And a really good fish to show it up. Almost seven and three quarter. Yeah, good wintertime bass. Okay, there you go. If it's that red, like I said, even their gillets and that. It's pretty much 100% crawdads. Now I'm going to follow this up with the tips and tricks. I are going a little to more, a little more detail about when to look for this and when it's really important to realize and focus on the fact that they're on a crawdad bite. But until then, I hope this helped. Until next time.